Aquatica Day. This is the queue to get into the park. To be expected, it's a Friday, spring break week. But the weather is gorgeous. Let's join the queue. We're in. And we're in. <laughs> it is busy and hot today. The queues are already, I mean, it's only been open an hour, but the queues are already pretty long. And here we've got the Lazy River. Ah, this is open now, I think. Is it open yet? Yes, it has opened. Okay. So, this slide here actually goes through like a, a dolphin enclosure, so you get to see the dolphins real quick as you shoot through. A lot of the life vests are already gone, but we've actually bought our own. So we're here. Now we're going to head over to Walkabout Waters. As we know where we're going and we know there's shade now. We are an hour late, so we're not sure if we're going to get the shade, but let's just see. There's the lockers. Already busy. We have these drying stations all around the park. Five dollars, but you're not going to need it today. So this is the queue to get into the Lazy River. Wow. Love the head lane. Here on the left, this is where you've got all your life vests. So I would recommend as soon as you get to the park to nab one and just keep it with you for the day. They come in different sizes. Let's see if we've got Rowers River Rapids and the Cabanas I was telling everybody about. You have to go across the bridge to access them. They range from around 299 from 299. as soon as you walk in the park come a little bit closer um here they're pretty close so go towards riptide races oh, there's no one here at these ones everyone always congregates at the lockers right at the beginning of the park just go a little bit further in and there's no queue okay so this is where we're going to try and set up camp this is where we we always come to this place because it's guaranteed shade we're at walkabout waters I did a big vlog on this the last time we were here, so I will post that in the comments below so you can have a look. There are the queues already going down to the bottom <laughs> for the family ride. Now we normally get a spot around here, but today we may be out of luck, but we got here at 11 as opposed to 10. So our bad if we don't. So we set up camp for the day. One of the recommendations I would get is to get one of these. Basically like an armband, but with a, like a front on it. It was $20 from Amazon, but it's, it's really light. You can just fold it over and just stick it in your bag. It's better than coming here and trying to rush to get a life vest because you will want one for the day. Um, so if you can, even if you buy one whilst you're out here, I'm pretty sure like the um, supermarkets would sell them too, but have a look around and see. But yeah, that's a, a tip for mine, bring your own float it and then that way you're not worried about um, trying to grab one and not having one or someone pinching it whilst you've gone for lunch or whatever. Tip. So if you're anything like me and hate spending six bucks on a soda in a theme park, do the smart thing. Take yourself down to the Family Dollar store, buy a pack of these, it's just the country time, pink lemonade, but Walmart have their own brand and Aldi sell their own brand. $1.15 for a pack of six of these. Open up the packet, stick it in your cup to make sure you bring your refillable cup. Go to any of the refillable stations around the park, top it up with ice. All of the um, um, water fountains can usually be found outside restrooms. Top it up with that, give it a stir, 
pink lemonade for what? 25, 30 cents? Tip. If you go shopping, make sure you pick up some of these. The towel clips. These were 6 99 from Bed Bath & Beyond. But they're brilliant. They're really, really good. And they're really easy to use. Um, so, and it's really helpful because a lot of the times these towels just literally fall off. You try and poke it in the hole but it never works. So yeah, invest in some of these. You probably get them off Amazon cheaper back home to be honest, but definitely worth it. The queue to get into the Lazy River today. Loggerhead Lane. Rapid Rivers, it's a lot quicker to get in. I think maybe they've got more entrance or exits or maybe it just goes round quicker. But yeah, to queue in to get into Lazy River just to give you a bit of an idea of how busy it is here today.